Atkins has been active in the nuclear industry for over 40 years now. Over the course of the last decade, given where the nuclear industry has been, we've very much focused on the UK marketplace. We are a leading player in the UK nuclear industry, supporting the commissioning fleet, supporting the generation fleet, and supporting the ever-increasing new build projects within the UK. We recognise, though, that we have a significant role to play in the worldwide nuclear renaissance. Atkins has an extremely strong brand right across the world, and we're looking to leverage that brand in many geographical sectors to move into the nuclear industries in those areas. It's also important to note the establishment of the NAAA joint venture with our friends at Sistema France, a joint venture set up to address the international new build markets, creating a significant organisation with access to thousands upon thousands of trained, deeply experienced nuclear engineers. Overseas, we play a significant role on the ITER programme, the future nuclear fusion research programme being built down at Cadarache in the south of France. Our role there as architect engineer means we not only have a huge opportunity to develop a massive skilled base of people that we can bring into the UK nuclear sector, but it also provides a great platform for us to build our overseas business. Atkins, as a member of the Engage Consortium, is responsible for the design, the support of procurement, and the construction management of all the buildings on this ETER project. As you can guess, the 39 buildings is pretty much heart of the delivery of the ETER project. Doing those, we are delivering all the buildings, but also the associated services and the infrastructure. For the big nuclear buildings, very much the heart of the facility, as well as all the rest of the platform. As I hope you can see behind me, we well advanced. We down there, we've actually excavated 200,000 of meter cube of rock to create the, the pit for the tokamak building. We're now pouring the lower base mats, so we've gone past the first nuclear concrete stage. Our design are obviously well advanced and we're getting ready to carry on on those buildings. What was quite impressive for Fusion for Energy has been the capability of Engage and Atkins to lead this team of designers, of engineers, more than 100 people all committed to deliver on time the design, uh, following the technical specification. When the project is completed in 2018, Atkins will go back with a wealth of additional experience. Additional design experience, you can't get anything much more complex. It's nuclear environment, it's a big research and development project, interfaces are extremely complex. And the ability to manage those kind of complexities is huge but we'll also take massive amount of new experience in the procurement of major projects and in the construction management and the construction supervision. Finally, we'll have learned to work with people from all over the world. We like to think that we've created a culture that people want to be part of. We recruit heavily at graduate level and we recruit heavily from it with the experienced engineer level. Importantly, in not only maintaining a strong culture, we also invest heavily in our people. We provide training, we have our own in-house nuclear training academy to nuclearise fundamentally those new graduates and those experienced engineers. We see that one of the future challenges for the nuclear industry is the skill shortage, both in the UK and worldwide. As Atkins, as one of the world's largest consultancies, one of the world's largest designers, we see it as our role to make sure that the nuclear market will be successful for years to come, which is why we make these high levels of investment. I started with Atkins about 11 years ago as a fresh graduate mechanical engineer and uh, been with Atkins ever since. You know, the next, the next five, ten years, I, I'm, I'm open to a number of things really in terms of whether it's going into a bit more engineering management, project management, business management. Um, uh, and I guess that's why, uh, that's why I enjoy working in a place like Atkins because actually those opportunities exist. I have to say I've been here one year. Um, I really, really enjoy the technical work. I'm a bit of a geek in that way. So ideally I would like to specialise technically. However, project management also has a bit of a pull towards me. So what I'm going to do is for the next couple of years continue with technical, see how that goes, and then maybe take on some small projects. And if I like that side of it, then it's probably where I'll end up. As the world economy grows and the world becomes a richer place in general, there is a huge requirement for massive amounts of energy right across the globe. In fulfilling that energy gap, it's important that we look for sustainable sources of energy. It's important that we look for low carbon sources of energy. 
Euclid, as the only proven large-scale generator of electricity, ticks all of those boxes. And in our kids, we see nuclear as being a fundamental part of the future energy mix. Thank you.